full of Wisconsin goodness, the Buffalo Cheese Curd Taco. The Buffalo Cheese Curd Taco! It was a quick celebration for the food stand Poncho Dog. After learning they won, Poncho Dog made quick work to make sure everyone knew their food was number one. It feels good to have something that I created be successful in any way. Richie O'Neill created the winner. I dubbed it the hot chick because it's got a buffalo cheese curd and grilled chicken in it. And it's got some nice blue cheese slaw and a cool the buffalo spice down, so it works out well. He had a good feeling he'd win after reactions like these. Mm. I tried those on Friday and yeah. they were good, so I try again. And it was a hard competition. Judges had the tough task of sampling all of them, but some, like Bucks president Peter Fagan, did a lot more than sample. I told my buddy he's going to drive home and I think I, it might, might be 12 minutes back to the city, but I might be dead asleep. While the foods range from sweet to savory, classic to unique, they all had a Wisconsin spin. The interesting foods are always a draw for my family. Um, I think it's a huge part of State Fair, and I love the fact that they showcase so many products from our state. You're kind of blown away by what the different tastes are, how thoughtful they are, what the balance is, how do people present it, so it was a neat experience. Peter Fagan was absolutely kicking himself that he didn't come up with a contest for fair foods where the winner could get a rotating spot at Fiserv Forum. It's definitely something to keep an eye on for next year. At State Fair, Sean Gallagher, today's TMJ4. And if I know Peter, he's thinking about it. All right, from <laughs> new foods at the fair to deals, head to tmj4.com.